Navigating the ERAT application is fairly simple. You have a few different options when it comes to zooming. You can zoom both in and out using the zoom in and zoom out buttons in the upper left hand corner, or you can use the mouse wheel. You can also double click on a desired point in the map to zoom in directly over the mouse click, or hold the shift key and drag a box around an area you would like to zoom into. Panning, or moving, in the map is as simple as clicking and dragging in the map window. You also have the option to use the arrow keys on your keyboard for more fine-tuned panning. When layers are turned on and visible in the map, they will be represented with their symbology and name in the legend, which you can find in the upper right-hand corner of the map window. Click the legend button to expand and view the legend, then click the right arrow to minimize it. If you have measurements or have selected data in the map and you would like to clear, click the Clean Up Map button next to the legend. The legend has to be minimized in order for the Clean button to be selectable. The ERAT application provides users with Street View functionality. Pretty cool. Simply click on the Street View character in the bottom right hand corner of the map window, click on a street you wish to enter in Street View, and then a Google Street View window will open at the closest point where Street View is available to your click. When the character is shrunk and standing on a pointed base, the Street View function is turned on and anywhere you click in the map, it will bring up the Street View window. To turn off the Street View functionality, simply click the character again. It should be larger and standing on a circular base when off. To return to the default extent of the entire county, click the Home button under the Zoom functions. You can check out more tutorials available on the JAX GIS YouTube page for more help.